Herbalife, right? Herbalife is just one big adventure. You can make it whatever you want. If you want to make it safe and secure, you can do that. We know some people that lived on a boat, right? <laughs> In the room. <laughs> they have a great life. I envy their life. And so uh, to other people that they're out going crazy around the planet Earth. And you can do whatever you want here. Isn't this unbelievable? Anything you want, you can get with Herbalife. <clears throat> One thing I want to kind of just challenge you on or give you an idea. Even in your personal life, because even in your personal life, let's say you're having uh, some challenges, uh, you know, your husband, wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, kids, boss, whatever, something's driving you nuts, okay, you're a St. Louis fan, whatever it is, I don't know, you know, <laughs> and I'm telling you, walk away from it for a little bit and just start doing Herbalife, start using more product, go get some lift off a shake, you know, take, take whatever, you know, as much product as you can. I'm convinced the more product you take, the more money you make. Because you simply feel better, okay? You have more energy, more stamina. So you use that product and you start talking to people. And because you're positive here, when you go back to your normal life, you start seeing it through solution-minded eyes instead of problemed eyes. You start going, what was I so upset about? That's not so important. Look, I just helped this person with the product today. I just signed up a couple distributors. It could change my life, their life. It's pretty extraordinary. And when you come back truly, you're going to learn how to be a problem solver here. You're going to learn to find solutions to things much more easily. And you're, not, and you're going to see other problems aren't such big problems, especially in Herbalife, especially now with the state of the world. So anyway, what do you do? How do you organize all this? For you, and you're going to hear this for the next 30 years, the first thing we all have to do, you've got to use the product yourself. All of you have been around people that have said the right words to you, a salesperson. And you said, you know, they're saying the right words, but I feel something's wrong here. I don't know what it is. They're just not telling me something. And you're probably right. They're not giving you the full truth. So if somebody says to you, do you really take those tablets three times a day? And you don't. But you go, oh, yeah, man, it's easy. Oh, yeah, I love it. It really makes me feel good, you know? <laughs> they're going to know. They're going to see it in your eyes. They're going to see it in your body language, your voice. They're going to sense. They're going to go, you know, I don't think something's right here where if you really do take it, you're gonna come on, I'll say, man, let me tell you something. I'm on this formula too because it's got vitamins and minerals, a cell activator, helps you to absorb everything better. I have bones, so I'm on extra cal. It helps your hair grow and your fingernails grow even faster. And, I, and you're gonna start going through it all. And you go, now you don't have to get on all that, but man, it makes me feel good. I'm you know, I have, I have surfing, I'm skiing. I wanna surf 100 days a year, I ski 50 days of the year. I'm playing my keyboard, steer, you know, still traveling the world. It's gonna help you for sure. You use the product, it's going to fuel you to get where you want to go and give you honest stories to tell. So now you're speaking from a position of truth and confidence. So you've got to use the product. If you're not doing that, and if, and if you've been around a while and you're saying to yourself, man, things aren't going as well for me as it is for those people, first thing I want you to truly examine and be honest with yourself is are you at really on the product every day? Not a shake here and there, or not a shakes, but no tablets. Are you really taking the product, okay? So let's say you are. And as you know, if you're new, and some of you are, get, go get some of our tea today, make a very dark glass, drink it quickly, in about two minutes your hair will stand up on its end. You go, man, this stuff gives you energy, I can't believe it. <laughs> yeah, so, now you have a product story. Then you have a shake and you go, man, this is good. Now you have another product story. You put some of that cologne or perfume on, you go, smell me. You got an immediate story. You put some of that skincare on, you look good immediately. I'm telling you. Most of the products get you a fast result, okay? So now you have that. Then the next thing you want to do, and this is one thing you should be thinking about tonight, tomorrow, when you're going home. What are your goals for the next 90 days? We got we're in the end of October, November, December, January. What happens around the world January 1st? Everybody resolves to lose weight, get healthy, make money, herb life, right? We got the answer, okay? Period, we have the answer. So, you, what you want to do is, but get goals. What do you want for the next 12 months for you and your family? And get as specific as you can be. The more specific you can be, the quicker you become the person that it takes to achieve your goals. If you vaguely say, I want to make a lot of money, 
what does that mean? To some people, a lot of money could be 500 extra bucks a month. You know, it could be a thousand, ten thousand. Well, what is it? You know, do you want a new car? Now, have realistic expectations. If you're brand new and broke, you might say, okay, one year I want a Bentley convertible, okay? Well, that's nice, but you know, maybe a realistic expectation of, okay, not a Bentley quite yet, maybe a Toyota, you know, whatever, Camry or whatever it is. So for me, I just wanted a car that started every time. All my cars were used cars, but I would just pray, please don't break down on the 405 and the 101 in Los Angeles at rush hour, okay? So. You want to get as many specific goals as possible and include in those goals the marketing plan. If you're not a supervisor yet, when are you going to be a supervisor? If you're not in world team, active world team, global expansion team, etc., start making some dates. And if you're not clear about the plan, this is where you talk to your sponsor, you go to the trainings, you go to the websites, okay? So make goals with the product, your personal health, with the, within our business, and then things you want. You know, so many people stop dreaming by the time they're in their mid-twenties because you're, when you're 18, 19, 20, a lot of people think, I'm going to do incredible things in my life, it's going to be fantastic. And this is probably truer now than ever. You get so beaten up by the time you're 25, you're going, hey, I'm doing okay. Yeah, I'm still living with mom and dad, but you know, I'll, I'll move, move out soon. You know, and I, I've got a car and I'm, I'm taking some trips, go to restaurants, that's okay. Yeah, I got a degree, I, you know, I'm still paying off those student loans. Anyway, so people stop dreaming because you don't want to set yourself up to lose. But in Herbalife, you, you're just beginning to see it if you're new. Whatever you want, you truly can get here if you're willing to use the product, wear the button, talk to people. Okay? Whatever. So, dream. Dream big. Think about what you truly want the next 12 months. Two to five years and five to ten years. Start thinking ahead. And as you grow here, you're going you're to refine that. Then the next step is, now that you have the goals, what's your plan? And that's what we're laying out. If you were here yesterday, today, tomorrow, what's your plan? The plan is invitations and presentations. You have to learn how to invite people to look at the product and invite people to look at the business. And then how are you going to present the products and the business? Remembering that almost everybody here, you're either in an organization that's working or you're near one, your region. Like in Los Angeles, we have HOMs every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday at the Herbalife headquarters in Torrance. Any of you can come by, okay? And there's things like that all over the country and all over the world. So you want to know where are the presentations going to happen because this is one of the biggest things I see around the world. If you or, you or your people aren't clear how the products will be presented, or the opportunity, then people quit inviting pretty quickly. Because if they invite somebody to look at the, you know, the products, and they can go, okay, when are we gonna meet? And you go, uh-oh, I don't know what to say. All of a sudden, you stop inviting. But this is why clubs, offices, weight loss challenges, this is why these things are pushing the business so much, because our people know they can invite people to the club, the office, the weight loss challenge, and they'll get a presentation on the product. They'll get a presentation on the business at our HOMs, at the SDSs, et cetera. So get a plan of action for 90 days so you know how to do invitations, presentations. Then from there, once you have a plan, keep honest statistics or gauges. And the key here, don't lie to yourself. See, if you lie to yourself and you say, well, I'm using the product, right? And I'm, you know, I'm talking to five people a day, 10 people a day, and you're truly not, then you start blaming Herbalife, the weather, your luck, <laughs> the government, your age, all this other stuff outside of you. And isn't that horrible if truly things outside of you determine your life? In Herbalife, you determine your life. And that could be scary, but it should be, it should be empowering to you. Okay? Absolutely. You determine what you want here. And we have paved the way and we will continue because we want to score. I want to make, I'm going to do in the next six, seven years what it took me 30 years to do, okay? I love you all, okay? But I want to take you with me. I don't want to say, oh, good job. Wish I had stuck around, all right? So keep honest gauges so you know what is working, whether you're working, so you, and what is working to continue it and teach it. From there, you'll have customers and distributors. So now you need to make sure you know the support system, which is what I was talking about. You know where the presentations are going to be done, the HOMs, the trainings, the STSs. 
We have the future presidents to team retreat coming up tomorrow. They'll talk more about this stuff.